Hey guys, it's Andrea with Sucks For You in Houston, Texas, and I started opening my Fairy Blooms package. It just came in the mail today and just stopped and thought, what was I doing? Why am I doing this all by myself? It's so much fun to do uh, these unboxings with y'all. Um, I know I love watching them um, when, when other people get stuff, and I like to go back and watch myself too. Um, <laughs> uh, this is not a succulent. This is the first thing I opened because it was the biggest thing in the box. Um, Fairy Blooms has selected the most ridiculous pile of spinach fettuccine. And she, she, she tells me this is actually an air plant. I'm not supposed to eat it with cream sauce. Um, I'll take her up on that and I will just give you a little look at that. Oh, there's this is new to me. Um, I've had some tinier air plants before, but definitely not uh, dinner plate size. Um, I really feel like a kinship to this. It's it's just kind of like maybe maybe it just needs to go like on my head. That you gotta find a way to get it on, to stay on my head, and then just wear it and be the most amazing person wherever I go in that moment with this on my head. <laughs> um, I have to play with the brightness really quick. The sun's coming out. It hasn't been out for three days and I'm so happy. <sighs> I can finally feel fully awake again. But it's messing up the brightness on here so we'll see. Put that back down. Okay. Okay. So. I don't know what else is in here. I opened this one first. It got a little crazy. I just had to start the video over. Um, but wow, dude, it's, it's huge. It's huge. Kind of scared of it, but you know they're pretty easy to handle as long as you just don't cook them. Don't give them too much water. Um, they're I think it's called epiphytes, where they soak up water from the air around them. So they don't really have roots that act like straws, they're just constantly taking in the uh, moisture of the air. Um, there's plenty of moisture in the air right now. Okay, so moving right along, this was just jam packed with pretty uh, paper, tissue paper keeping everything in place. Um, okay, make sure I'm actually recording. Um, so sorry, I'm yawning on here. Uh, I really don't feel fully awake until the sun is out. I need to see a little bit of blue sky um, to believe I should be awake. So um, when I got this package this morning, it definitely helped perk me up now that the sun's coming out. Um, you want to see first? Hold on. I don't know which way is up. I don't even know what it is. Uh, hold on. I think I do know what it is. Uh huh. Oh my gosh. I can't wait. <gasps> oh my gosh. This might be the mystery succulent. This is like this chunky. It's heavy. You know, I've been wanting one of these for a really long time. I don't know if it's the exact same kind, but. If I'm not mistaken, they might get pink, and they look like crab claws. And it reminds me of that scene in Beetlejuice when they're all around the dinner table, and um, they're singing the uh, Deo song, right? And then the claw comes up out of their plate and just like grabs them by the face and like, pushes them back. That's what these remind me of. Um, I'll look this up, and of course, list the name of it below. It's spiky. The spikes are definitely... Spiky. Um, let me fix that. And then we have, it's heavy. Really, it, it's thick and heavy and um, has nice roots. Ouchy. And these are really cool. Ow. Aren't those neat? Got a little dirt. Dirt don't hurt, don't. Mm. That's cool, huh? Oh, yeah, look at it that way. 
Okay. Uh, we will be moving right along. Um, dang. Sorry. I always say we're moving right along and then I come back. Let's talk and look at it at the beginning. How's that? I want you to be able to admire them. This chair is too high up, but that's okay. Okay. I'm not going to yawn again. Do you want to see it first? I keep forgetting, but I think that's fun too. Hold on. i got to figure out which... I'm just going to open it because I don't know which way is up on this guy. <gasps> I got a... This is um, Crassula Morgiana, I think. It's Morgan's... Um, Morgan's Pink. And I have a Crassula Falcata. But I don't have this one. And I did not expect the flowers. Ah, uh, I am so excited. I have wanted this since I reposted someone else's picture a long time ago. <laughs> oh, man. You guys, you guys, Angelique, Fairy Blooms. It's okay. Oh, wow. Oh, man. Oh, man. I was, like, expecting maybe one of them, not one, two, three, four... I don't know. I don't know how to count them. Oh, I wish the sun was out more because the color on here is just so pretty and delicate. Oh man, I love it so much. I love it. It's heavy too. It's like. I don't know. It's just heavy. Um, so once I get these potted up and dusted off, I'll get some good, pretty pictures with my camera. Tiny little flower bloom broke off. That's okay. Just one. I don't know how she does it. How do these plants just behave in the mail? I don't know. I'd be so afraid to ship that with the flowers. I mean, tiny little leaf breakage. I don't know if it'll propagate. Probably not, but, um, nothing. No big deal at all. Very excited about that. Very excited about it. Um, oh, man, so far so good. Let's see, let's see. Let me look at my list and see if I can guess. Okay. Mm -mm, I don't know what it is. Try and feel it. it. Smells like like a hotel. I don't know. It smells like something. I think I felt a prick. Hold on. Am I tripping? Damn it! Hold on. I'm not in there yet. I'm not in there yet. We're gonna see it together. Ready? Almost. Uh, Careful with this one. Ah. Lady love. Oh. Oh. Make the brightness up here a little better. I don't know what this one is either. It's cactus, obviously, and it's in bloom. And it's got this, oh, it's so pretty. It's like a little redhead, like reddish brown spikes on top. Um, and these most adorable crown of flowers. Can you see it better? Like, I put a white background. Oh, man. I'm shopping dirt on my computer, but I don't even care. Look. Oh, I love you. I'm going to get in with the teasers and take out the little dirt. Boy, you clean up real nice. Oh. Well, that's going to be really cute without the flowers, too. I mean, that's just... There's a lot of blooms still... That haven't opened. I think right there. Right there. Um... Oh man, I'll tell you what. 
this time last year I did not have the same appreciation for cactus cacti that I did now this I was just really into the pretty pastel rosettes and the brighter the color the better um, but I mean those are great and all but give me a weirdos any day any day give me your uglies give me your oddballs um, yeah I mean they're still beautiful of course um, but I do think it's like some things cactus and certain other plants maybe uh, like uh, I don't know say the desert rose or just the things that don't they're not pretty they they're just unique and um, I mean I think a lot of people do think they're pretty but they're not like you know your standard beauty right we don't need any of that I don't I really don't know if I'm gonna be able to capture the color on this in any with any kind of camera um, yeah I don't know what this one is I, it, it's we're gonna say we're starting out with the LO and I'm assuming that it's listed on the website and um, just playing with the light here to try and okay so I guess I'm gonna have to describe the color when you look at it from one direction it's green and then you look at it from another and there's like red and then you look straight down in it and there's these glowing I think that's a pretty good representation of the color but of course it's every all of these are always more beautiful in person oh my gosh That is really cool. It's like the, there's definitely like a rainbow effect going on like down in here. Again, just be sure to check back here in a few days on my Instagram account and um, it, su it sucks for you. And um, I'll have some, I'll try and get some good pictures. Like the waiting on good natural light. Again, we haven't had any in, I don't know, I think this is the fourth day. But it's been raining and overcast. Just rough, dude. I know it's rough for a lot of people. Um, but hey, it's not cold. <laughs> it's really not. I mean, it was cool earlier, but right now it's, it's probably like 70. So that makes me happy. Um, okay. So, oh, there's more than what I thought. Okay. Here we go. Who are you? Oh, yeah. Worker, worker, one nine. This is a neon breaker. It's really cool. This is um, it's a little darker than the one I have. I, they go, they change colors so much. Um, I can't wait for a sunny day to do an unboxing video. I just had to do it, but I just feel like I have to apologize for. the lighting they're so pretty um neon breakers are amazing they do really well in houston texas i have one in another pot but i am locked into where are you are you over here no i have another one um and it's just doing great and i've seen it it's just like it's like watching the sun rise and the sunset it changes colors because bright pink and then when the sun hits the edges of it they just that's where it gets the neon uh, part in its name um, it really does look like it's glowing from within uh, this is so pretty mm. sweet babies <sighs> um, here we go what are you oh I know what this one is I think mm, is that you <laughs> Poor baby. So, I should have opened these first. <sighs> oh, 
Okay, that's not bad. Sorry. These are um, the cocoon plant, a, a, a woolly senecio, and they got a little bit of dirt on them, which is fine because that means they have really good roots. And I am better odds of not killing them. I, I have a problem with these sometimes. I don't, I'm still trying to figure them out, but I love them and I keep giving them a chance. And um, I, I have several that are doing great. Um, but, I mean, they're green underneath the white, but that white does kind of block out the uh, chlorophyll, I'm assuming. So I block the sun from the chlorophyll maybe helps uh, maybe it makes it a little bit harder for them to um, photosynthesize so just I think once you get once you get them going they get really happy and they just put up with whatever you throw at them but me I'm still learning you know best methods for these guys and um, yeah I have some right here and they're doing great and let me put those guys here. Come back a little bit more. I did get a new camera, but I'm just learning how to use it and need to charge it up. And so it's okay. This will work one more time. I was going to show you really quick. That's my other cocoon plant as it's listed on Fairy Bloom's website. And um, <laughs> can't put it back. I, mean, I can't talk and look at plants at the same time. That takes talent, and I just don't. I don't have that. Um, one more. Who is it? Hold on. Let me see if. Uh huh. Okay, I didn't do this on purpose, I swear. I haven't opened it yet. I see it kind of through the hole in a little bit of paper. I think I'm going to have to say that we saved the best for last. And I swear this is real. I swear this is a real plant. I've never seen this in person before. I got goosebumps on my, my right knee. <gasps> oh, here we go. You ready? I can't believe this is mine. It's a Hawaiian pumela. Um, I don't know if it's like a particular variety. I know there's a few different varieties. I know they're highly sought after. And as you can see, it's like just chunky little fat salt or sugar covered I thought I heard something I think it was my dog um I don't even know how to tell you how awesome it is here let's <laughs> show you again look at it y'all okay can you, let me see if I can get the texture. Can you see those bumps? Can you see how lovely and lifted and how white and the contrast? Sorry, I'm yelling. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. <sighs> okay. Sorry, I should cover it. There's my mic. I can cover up the mic. Freak out, man. This is... Oh, I love you. Okay, well, I want to go be alone with these guys for a little while. So, um, eventually I'll get around to taking some pictures and um, posting the IDs on under the descriptions. I'm going to get as close as I can. I'm going to uh, study up on my... Uh, Pesto recipe? No, I'm just kidding. Um, this is just... Man. Hold it. 
frame, so... Okay. I'm gonna click view. Real quick, I had somebody um, ask me about this ring. And they're like, is that a middle finger? Is that a cactus? <laughs> it's a cactus. Pretty cool, huh? I don't know. Like, just, can you even, should I just leave them here and just let you look at them? Oh man, today's a good day. So, thank you for watching. Um, if you have any questions, leave them below. And, um, oh, oh, for now, um, if it changes, I'll let you guys know. I have a website, sucksforyou.com. I do have a promo code for Fairy Bloom site. Um, I get, well, if you use the promo code, and I'll put it down on the bottom too, sucks for you, um, it's, you get 15% off. So that's like, that's like tax free, that's like some of your shipping, and it's definitely, that's a good, that's, depending on what all you get, that's definitely um, a great value. 15% off. Um, <sighs> Okay, I think that's it for now. <laughs> Thanks, guys. Uh, see you soon. I, I always do that because there's dirt on my computer. Not, I just don't, I don't have a random blowing problem. Okay, I stop now.